Now let's talk about the import CSV commandlet here. The import CSV commandlet creates a table like custom object from the items in the CSV file. And each column in the CSV file becomes a property of the custom object and the item in row becomes a property values. Import CSV work on any CSV files, including files that are generated by the export CSV commandlet. So let's go to the PowerShell command prompt and let's see an example. And if you want to see the parameters of import CSV commandlet, then we can take help of get help commandlet. So mention get help and write import csv. Hit enter. And here we can see import csv command that supports path parameter, delimiter parameter, return path parameter and so on. Now let us see an example. First we will export all the processes in a csv file. Then we will try to import that file. So to get the list of all the running process on the system, we will take help of get process command led here. And let's export everything to a CSV file. And for that, we will take help of export CSV commandlet here. And then we have to mention the path. And let's give a file name and let's say import file.csv. And we don't want that type information header. And to remove that, write no type, no type information parameter here and hit enter. So the file has been created on the desktop. We can verify if you come here and here we can see import file.csv open this and it has the list of all the running process on the system. Now let's try to import this file and to do that we will take help of import csv command led here. So write import CSV. Then we have to mention the path from where we have to import this. And let's say import file dot CSV. Hit enter. And here we can see we have successfully imported the file 